Hey, we got Sean Higgins here with us, so that means we're going to be talking a little bit about some sports. Yes. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yes, that's absolutely right. Hey, I got a question. Did you guys know in just a few days, March 11th, sports betting is going to be live here in North Carolina? <laughs> it's coming to North Carolina? I know, it's so what? shocking. Well, you absolutely should know. Of course you did, because we've been constantly berated by ads like these. Mm -hmm. Seems like every sports book has deployed NC-based ads. If you just give us a second here, you'll see some of the ones I'm talking about. <laughs> It'll have familiar faces like Kevin Hart and Jamie Foxx, while also using former mm. Duke star JJ Redick, mm -hmm. stuff like that. Now, before, oh, here you go, right there. See, that's that's <laughs> from Instagram, there oh, you go. Yeah. And then there's some other ones. There's Kevin Hart right oh. there, relaxing, talking about sports betting. But before we talk about sports betting, I want to know, what, what's your guys' like, we know when it's going to happen, but what's your experience with sports betting? Either, either one of you, got anything? I've got no experience over here, but, you know, obviously it's, it's a very popular thing, and a lot of folks are very excited about it. What yeah. about you, Hunter? Anything? I've done, like, the NCAA brackets, and then, okay. you know, everyone puts in a pool of money, but okay. I've never gotten to use the app before. Yeah. All right. Well, yeah. for new gamblers, some of the terminology can be kind of hard to get over. So let's yeah. go through some today. Let's I'm going to do, do a little quiz for you. Guys, you ready? All right. Let's put you guys on the spot. If I were oh to say gosh. the word money line, what do you think that means in a gambling sense? Money means money. Perfect. A line like means a straight line. Mm -hmm. So, um, or not a straight line. I'm going to say money line is um, the money you're putting in. Close. Sydney, any guess? I support you're gonna go, that answer. You're going to go with team? Well, <laughs> not, good not, answer. Good answer. <laughs> Little family feud, not quite right. <laughs> so money line would just be like a straight up bet. You're just yeah. picking who's gonna win, win or lose. Um, it's a really simple way to explain it, but that's mm, what that is. Okay. Now what if I said spread? Now I'm not talking about what you put on a bagel, <laughs> right, or a piece of toast, but spread Peanut in butter. terms of picking against the spread. Any idea what that might be? I mean, I would just say that it's like what your contenders not like bad. What you're looking at. I, I, I was going to say something yeah. similar around yeah. that. All right, all right, I'm not going to answer this one. I'm going to let a professional answer. What I like does the sound spread of mean? <laughs> it is a uh, a number that is placed on by the sports books that a certain team has to win the game by. So if it's let's say the Charlotte, you know, Hornets, and they've got to win by three points, the spread is three. If they win by four, you win your bet. If they win by two, you lose your bet. Right. Oh. So makes kind of sense, right? Yeah. So those are like your two major, every game you bet on, you can bet on the money line okay. or you can bet on the spread. And there's underdogs and favorites. Betting on an underdog means higher risk, higher reward. Mm. So it's just kind of a good way to get you started. We got about 20 seconds left of this chat, but I want to know, um, what have people been saying on social media, especially specifically here in our state, once this goes live and active and everything? There, you know, there's a lot of excitement, which makes sense, but okay. I, I got a caution that, you mm. know, you definitely don't want to bet more money than you're willing to lose because right. losses are going to happen a lot more than wins. Mm. Yep. And, and just keep it fun, keep it light, and if you find yourself in a problem, there's going to be tons of resources for you to get 